this is hands down the best crochet here i've worn in a long time like i am so in love like if i didn't tell you guys that this is a crochet here you wouldn't have guessed Hey lovelies, welcome back to another Hair Inspo video and today's video is sponsored by QVR Hair and we're going to be installing these small kinky curly feather crochet braids. The color is T2 slash 30 and I'm going to be using five packs to get the look that you saw earlier in the intro of the vid. And just for reference, this is 20 inches long and it's 100% human hair. It's gonna be my first time installing a hair like this in the crochet form and what I really love too is the thread that's there at the loop. It makes it easier for the hair to lie flat so you don't have that bulking when you're through with it. All you need is just your crochet needle for the installation and I had cornered my hair back in around eight, I think it is, for this style. So you can do it vertically if you so decide or horizontally. It depends on which would suit the style you're going for. So for today, this is how I am going to put it in. The hair may seem as if it's not going to be enough because that was my first thought when I saw it. But when I started to pull it apart and install it, I'm like, okay, this will definitely do it. <laughs> this part i'm using some mousse and i have a spray bottle as well that i'm using to spray on the hair i also have some curling oil and i will be using a gel in it i had to relocate to my room as i'm using some different lighting and i'm just experimenting at this point so the other one wasn't giving what it's supposed to give after i was through so this one is a little bit better so i'm working with it here but back to the hair I am using a detangling brush to brush the curls out and get the products in so we can style it accordingly. Let's do a little comparison. This is the hair before and then this is it after brushing it out. So we're going to go back in and apply some more products and get the desired curls. <music> requires a little patience as we have to do it in parts because you don't want it to get all tangled up and everything and because you're brushing it entirely out well you don't have to but i wanted to brush mine entirely out so i can get the look i want 
and also i'm gonna give you guys two styles in this one video because the first one i'm leaving it as is i'm not doing anything at all to it and then the second style i'm gonna actually cut it in a somewhat of a bob look i love these curls they're looking so juicy i can't wait for them to really be defined but this hair has really impressed me and this is my honest feedback not because it's being sponsored but the hair is really really soft there's not a lot of shedding other than the usual because you know you're brushing and manipulating the hair so you're bound to have some shedding but this is very minimal and it's not easily tangled so that's a win-win <laughs> Here is the final look somewhat because I'm going to go in again. But you can't tell me that this is not a sewing. Like, look at it. versatility at its best because you see all those styles i was able to achieve with this one look and well this one here i mean not look but here and this right here it's given it's given traditional sewing crochet hair has really really changed the game because you think it and you can get it done with a crochet hair how you can tell i'm really feeling myself because look at me go i am really really over the top and really pleased with this i had it cut off camera but at this point i was like jesus i think i've spoiled the hair and then because some parts were actually done shorter than some but then i played with it i fluffed it here i fluffed it there and then voila look at this like I can't be any more in love with this here. So it depends on your style preference. You can either go with it long or you can go with it short. As for me, I'm a little bit torn in the middle because I really love the short look. And I also love the versatility of the long look. But you can be the judge of that. Which do you prefer? The long or the short? I'll check the comments to see what your responses are. If you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and share as well. If you haven't subscribed to my channel as yet, please go ahead and do so. Don't forget to check out the description box for the deeds on the here.